morning. We're up nice and early. So even fancy some breakfast this morning. I don't think we've had breakfast since we've been here. So I'm just making some eggy bread. We finally got around to making it. We bought the stuff like one day last week, like Thursday or something last week. Finally getting around to making it. Although they haven't got any oil for I can't find any oil. So we're just making do with the dry pan. There you go. Just two slices, yeah? Yeah. Like a fork or using your fingers? Fingers. fingers. Nice to finally have some breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we have a slight problem. We can't get out. We're locked in. We've just gone to leave and we're padlocked in. We normally have a key for the padlock, but she wanted it back yesterday so she could get in. And now we are keyless and locked in. So I need to try and get in touch with someone who will let us out. <laughs> oh dear. Well, I have tried getting in touch with people to say we're locked in. I haven't had anything back at the moment, so I guess we just kind of sit tight and wait until somebody either comes and lets us out or gets back to me or something. I'm going to maybe do a bit of editing whilst we wait. But I'll start to wonder where we are soon enough, surely, because it's like 28 minutes past 8 and we're supposed to be there at half 8, so we'll see. Look, I just got a message back. She put our keys on the door. I never saw them. Oops, never mind. We're going to be a bit late this morning. It's like 20 to 9 already. Right, you ready to go? Yeah. Let's go. We're finally on our way. Better late than never, hey? <laughs> And I'm gonna go home. We've just been invited. We've just been invited tonight to one of the teachers' birthdays. We're going for a meal or something. So that's at six o'clock. So I'm not gonna have to do my run this evening. So I'm gonna, when I get home, go for my run now. It's kind of like the worst time of the whole day to go for my run at like 12 o'clock. Pure midday heat. But I'm gonna go for it. We've just done the walk home and the thought of now going for a run in that heat. It's filling me with dread. I'm gonna just get changed and go. I'm not gonna sit down, because if I sit down, I'm just gonna completely change my mind about going out in that heat. It is so warm. I'm going. I think I'll probably only manage like a mile because otherwise I think I'll just pass out. <laughs> turned everything on, thank you. So much sweat. Stephen has turned the air con on. Freezing cold and the fan and everything on. That's so nice to walk into. After being out there, oh my goodness. Oh. I only did like a mile and a half because Oh, look how red I am. Oh, goodness. I am going to hop in the shower. Get rid of all the sweat. I don't think I've ever been so sweaty. Oh, it's gross. Get rid of all the sweat. I don't need to get on with editing. Yesterday's vlog. I'm so red. I'm so red. Oh, my goodness. Wow. We are on our way back to school now. I've had a very frustrating couple of hours with my editing. My hard drive, right? Still on hard drive. Just keeps not being recognised. And it is driving me completely and utterly mental. I don't know what's the matter with it. I keep like click because I store all my footage that I do each day on my external hard drive, and then when I go to when I've gone to try and like edit it, the external hard drive just isn't showing up. It's driving me mental. So anyway, we're on our way back to school. If we don't get run over along the way, crazy. Hello. But they're nice on this corner. Five of them that always say hello to me. Nice. Well, they never try and sell me anything. Maybe they, yeah, maybe. Oh, look, I was being all innocent and saying that they're nice. We're all done with school. It's half past four. We're just quickly heading home. I'm gonna go home for about an hour or so because we're gonna be back at school for six o'clock for this party thing, this birthday thing that we're going to. 
We've been back at home for a little while, about 45 minutes or so. Did a little bit of editing and things. Actually, not that much. We watched some Pokemon videos, if I'm honest about what we did. We're just heading back up now. Go to this. I'm thinking it's just like a birthday meal thing. I have no real idea, to be honest, what we're going to. We did say that we're having hot pot, which, let's be honest, I can't eat. <laughs> so, I don't like. And Stephen doesn't like. So, it's going to be. Um, a great evening by all accounts. Oh well, sorry, we'll see. Oh look, a Diddy card. Do you know those things we have in Spain? Oh, I've got a normal wheel. Oh yeah, but it's still a Diddy car. Now this is crazy. How are you supposed to not get hurt walking out into this madness? Complete madness. Right, ready? Let's just go. You just have to kind of go and hope for the best. Go, go, go. <laughs> we made it. Yes. yes. Not yet. No. We made it. <laughs> there is a knack to the whole crossing the road thing over here. It's kind of just keep one speed and just go with it. And they will go round you. First of all, when you first get over, that feels kind of scary that that's not really going to work, but it really does. Just kind of just go and they'll just dodge you. No, no, it's, I mean, when there's loads of them, that's quite difficult. But, yeah. Where next row is? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. There's a massive, huge road up here near the school, and that's pretty crazy to try and cross, but generally, it works. I was watching on the cameras there in all the rooms. I think this looks like our little party going on upstairs. Doesn't look much like a hot pot to me, to be honest. Hot pot is one dish. This is many dishes. We're heading up now. No hot pot that we've been Wow. Four after what? We're having a bit of a teaching. Stephen how to learn chopsticks. How to learn chopsticks. How to do chopsticks. You're doing well. You're doing good. I think you can do it. Yeah? You reckon you can do it? We've had a very nice time at the party, but I'm not joking these people. They eat and eat and eat. They haven't stopped eating. I mean, they're all so tiny and slight and thin and everything, but geez, they've been eating. <laughs> we're going home now. It's been good. I'll chat to you when we're home or on the way. We're just leaving now on our little wander back home. It's been a nice little evening, but like I just said, they don't half eat. They're, they're so tiny and small, but they just sit and eat and eat and eat and eat. Right, the three of well, the, the three of us, the four of us kind of. So there's me, there's an American, there's me, there's an American girl, and there's um, a lady from Spain, and then Stephen. We finished eating like 20 minutes into the whole thing. They're still sitting there eating now. I know it's all healthy stuff and everything, but they just sit and eat more and more and more. It's craziness. Anyway, we're wandering home. It's the first time Stephen has seen the darkness in Vietnam. I think he hasn't been outside when it's night. In the oh yeah, oh yeah, you did, yeah, yeah. That's a lie. When we were in Central Hanoi, yeah, we saw the dark then. Yeah, yes, we did. It was a good, dead nice evening. Like I was just saying last night. I think if you watched yesterday's vlog, I was saying that we need to do things in the evening and things. And so it was just nice to go, go down to school and have some tea with everyone. And I don't know how they put cream. Yeah, 
Uh, me and Stephen were having a conversation the other day. I'm a bit scared of walking this road in the dark. I'm not. Okay, stay together. Before, after the car. Before, after, I mean. Okay, no, yes. Yeah. No, I mean, after the car. Oh, number four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That doesn't, yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Um, me and Stephen were having a conversation and we don't know the answer to this. This is something else that I need to Google. How do they get queens up? How do they get queens up in the air? Do you know? You don't know. Anybody who knows how they get queens up? It's something we talk about actually quite regularly. We talk about it quite regularly. At least once a week we have a conversation about queens. They can't use another crane. They can't use another how crane. How do they get that queen no. up? I'm gonna Google it so I know the answer once and for all. We are back at home, oh my goodness. It is so warm inside when you've been out. It's a nice, bless you. Nice breeze out there as soon as you come in. Oh, my upload, just think of my upload, it's on like 40, 48%. It takes about 12 hours to upload a vlog in this place. I think what I need to do actually, what time is it? It's only quite early. I need to phone my mother. I think I was supposed to FaceTime her on Sunday, I think it was, when we got back from Hanoi City and I never did, so. What time is it in England? Two, two three o'clock-ish. I'm gonna try and phone her. Hello? We have poor connection, it keeps cutting out. Okay, if you're watching mum, I am trying to phone you back. It's just not really working. Complete failure of a FaceTime with my mum. About 28 FaceTimes later. Just keeps reconnecting and breaking up. She keeps persisting. It's not working mum, give it up. Oh, I am so shattered. No idea why. Absolutely shattered. I've been waking up far too early, like half past five-ish don't know why need to sort that one out but anyway i am going to get into bed now so i hope you've had a wonderful day whatever you've done and i will see you guys tomorrow good night